Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope all of you are doing great. In this video, I will show you guys list of affordable products for beginners, especially because if you are a beginner, it's very important to buy the products according to your skin type. So I will show you guys the products for oily skin and dry skin separately. So without any further ado, let's just quickly get started with this video. Very important to use a primer because it will also last long your makeup. It will also act as a skin care. It will also make your skin texture very smooth. So when you apply foundation on top of it, your foundation will go on very very smoothly. You know. So in India, it's hard to find an affordable primer. So the one that I have is the by the Lakme. I have tried it like many times. I do use it on my makeup tutorials as well because it fills in my pores and it also makes my skin texture very very smooth. So I absolutely love this primer. So when I have oily skin. it works for me when i have dry skin it works for me so i absolutely love this one so that's why uh, i have included this in this video now the second thing is foundation uh, now for everyday basis you do not have to uh, apply foundation so you can apply bb cream uh, instead this one is by pons this is my holy grail bb cream i absolutely love this because it does suits dry skin it does suits oily skin it has a very nice yellow tinge to it which cancel out all the darkness and pigmentation on your face plus the coverage is amazing uh, so for a bb cream uh, to have this kind of a coverage i think that this product is amazing for that so now let's talk about foundation Now for dry skin people, I will recommend you guys this Nykaa Skin Genius Foundation. Uh, I use this foundation all the time in my makeup tutorials because it has a beautiful dewy finish to it. Uh, it it does not have like a very very dewy finish, but it has a very beautiful natural shine to it. But it's very very thin and moisturizing in the texture. Plus it also hides all the dry patches. Uh, so it's amazing. It's very moisturizing, very hydrating, and amazing for the season like uh, this kind of a season. So for dry skin people, I will highly 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 recommend this Nykaa Skin. genius foundation it's amazing so for oily skin people i will recommend you guys this uh, maybelline fit me foundation this is amazing for oily skin people because it does not it doesn't slide off your face because when you get greasy greasiness on your face it doesn't slide out plus it also stay very longer plus it also hides all your pimples and blemishes whatever you have on your face it also hides that so it has a very nice coverage and it also stays for a long period of time and it is absolutely matte uh it is absolutely matte finish so that is amazing for oily skin people so for oily skin people i recommend this maybelline fit me foundation plus my shade is 115 ivory and the nykaa skin genius foundation i have 01 pure ivory so now for concealers now it's important to use a concealer because if you have a perfect base your makeup is going to look very very beautiful now everybody has some sort of under eye circles now for under eye circles it's important to have yellow based concealer don't go for like a foundation don't go over that because for that i like to use this bharat and doris concealer i use this concealer uh, only on my under eye circles or sometimes i like to apply it here because So I have some sort of pigmentation on this area, so I, I use this Bharat and Doris concealer, and it is in the shade zero one, fair. And uh, even though it's it's zero one, it is a little bit yellow for my skin tone, so I like to apply it on my under eye circles because what happens is if I don't apply yellow uh, undertone concealer, I have a grey sort of a hue, so I don't like that kind of a look. So that's why I like to apply yellow undertone concealer so that it cancels out all the darkness and the greyishness that I have underneath, and then I like to apply a foundation on top of it, and then it looks flawless. But if you have like huge pigmentation going on, I will recommend you guys uh, go for LA Pro concealer. Also have like a peach. color and orange color so uh, you can buy that according to your pigmentation plus it will also suit dry skin and oily skin easily don't want a yellow undertone concealer if you want something for your face uh, you can go for this pack derma refills they have like huge uh, variety of colors in this one uh, this is how it comes like uh, this is how uh, the packaging is it is actually uh, the refill So I have used it quite a lot. Uh, this one is for dry skin people because it is extremely creamy, and uh, if you have oily skin, you might it might crease on you. Uh, but for oily skin, I will recommend this again, Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. This is amazing. They also have a very huge variety of uh, shades in it, so you can find a shade for yourself. This is amazing for oily skin people. It's a it's a very nice coverage concealer, and uh, you can also go for uh, that LA Pro Conceal. That one is also very nice, uh, but that one sets very quickly, so you kind of have to work very. 
quickly but just learning a makeup i used to go like very very slow with my makeup so uh, i didn't like i will not recommend that concealer if you are a beginner because that sets very quickly and you cannot just work that quickly if you are a beginner because you don't have that kind of a speed so next thing is setting your face now that you now that you have applied everything on your face that you need it's important to lock it in the place so that it doesn't move uh, that much so i will recommend this uh, maybelline uh, so I recommend you guys this Maybelline White Super Fresh Powder. It is amazing for oily skin people. It is amazing for touching up basically. Like if you have some sort of oil secretion on your face for oily skin people, it just seeps all the oil out and it will also make your face very nice and matte. So this is amazing. I've used it quite a lot. Just check this out. It also comes with a puff. I've used it quite a lot because it is amazing and it is amazing for touching up. So you can just throw it in your purse and you are good to go. You can touch up whenever you want. But if you have some sort of texture going on on your face go for this one this is the l'oreal matte magic powder this is absolutely matte it just sets or everything in the place uh, plus it will also blurs out all the textures on your face like everybody has some sort of textures on their face because we are human right uh, so this one just blurs out all the texture that you have on your face and it is amazing uh, this is my second one uh, I kind of emptied up <laughs> the first one so I got the second one because I absolutely love this plus the shade that I have in this is let me check. plus uh, my shade is N2 Nude Vanilla and this one is Pearl and this one is pearl uh, so i absolutely love this one as a setting powder but if you want something for baking now every everybody knows that baking is so much in the rage right now so if you want something for baking you can go for this one lacme absolute uh, whitening rose powder i have also reviewed this on my channel just click here if you want to watch that review it's uh, very in, uh, very inexpensive just for 160 rupees and the quantity you get is quite huge uh, it's uh, it's 27 grams and I think that it's gonna last you a very long period of time. Uh, so if you wanna check the review on this one, just click here. It's amazing for baking. Blushes, now blushes are like very, very important, plays a huge uh, role in your makeup because it does makes your cheeks look very pretty, very, uh, you know, plumbed up and does uh, makes you look like a human being, okay? So now a natural sort of a look, I will recommend you guys to go for cream blushes because cream blushes are basically in cream texture. So it just blends into your skin very beautifully and gives you that natural uh, you know plumped up natural flushed cheeks which does looks pretty right uh, so go for this Maybelline dream touch blush it is amazing it is quite pigmented so just be a little bit careful for it about it uh, I have it in the shade 07 and it's a beautiful shade very natural uh, something very very natural just go for cream blushes but make sure that, that you are not applying blushes uh, cream blushes over powders because that will make you look patchy uh, so applying your foundation then apply cream blush and uh, then set it with a powder don't don't apply powders before uh, creams right so uh, go for uh, powder blushes i have these two options for you guys uh, to heaven and uh, this is how the shade looks like it's very beautiful pigmented blush it's blend out makes your cheeks look streaky whatsoever it does blend out very beautifully and the shade is 504 option that i have is this miss Claire, uh, blushes these are amazing comes in a huge variety of shades so you can choose a shade and this kind of color in this range it's a very crazy orange color uh 27 and this is the shade 04 you can also go for these ones they also blend very nicely they are pigmented so just be a little bit careful about it and they also blend very nicely so yeah I have a great option for bronzer that is uh, this one from Blue Heaven shade is 505 it looks beautiful on you it has a little bit sheen to it so uh, it does make your bronzing looks very very beautiful it does gives a dark skin tone you can use this one as a highlighter as well now and for, now for highlighters you can just watch this video of mine I have 10 options for you guys so you can choose a highlighter for yourself uh, by watching this video uh, all of them are affordable options so you can just go ahead and watch this video this is done let's jump up to our eyes now as we all know eyeshadows can be a little bit expensive if you go uh, if you like search for good quality eyeshadows so you can go for these kind of uh, quads these one are by Maybelline they are amazing very nicely pigmented blends very nicely they also have like uh, 
quite many uh, shade options for you so you can choose a shade for yourself this is the divine pink they also have bunch of shades so you can choose a shade. if you wanna buy eyeshadow palettes at all just go for these they are beautiful they are ts cosmetics glitters now you can find mention this eye glitters in many of my videos if you and if you ask me that where to buy it you can buy it from instagram store called ts cosmetics uh, you can buy it from her she's amazing you have to apply any glue whatsoever it's just a cream based eye glitters they're beautiful looks very very pretty on your eyes so just this you do not have to do anything else just apply some sort of uh, you know this kind of eyeshadow or any any of your matte blushes on the crease and uh, pop this on the top and you're all good to go just make sure to apply so I, I just advertise it a lot she, she's not paying me anything so let me clear that out any good eyeshadow palette I will recommend you guys this uh, makeup revolution naked underneath palette they uh, they also have other colors as well but the one that I love in general particularly is this one this is amazing it has also palette dark dark smoky colors and neutrals as well so it's a very versatile palette you can go for this kind of a palette it will cost you not buy uh, these glitters I have also another option for you guys this is a little bit expensive this is also by makeup revolution looks very beautiful this is the uh, eyeshadow foils these are the metal foils and it does looks like a foil on your eyelids it looks very pretty i have used it in many of my uh, makeup tutorials just check here i've used it here and uh, liners uh the one that i love the most is this nika black magic eyeliner it's amazing it has a little bit shine to it if you don't like this go for like shiny eyeliner you can also go for sugar cosmetics eyeliner that one is totally matte jet black and uh, this is the nika one that i will recommend you guys because i absolutely love this plus you can also go for the Maybelline uh, color show eyeliner I just forgot to bring it so uh, that one is also very nice you can also go for that one they are like colored and they are very very affordable like just for 250 or something so you can also go for that now I apply kajal but if you'll ask me plum kajal is very nice and the one that in the new launch by Nika that one is also very nice so you can go for that one or uh, what I like to do is I like to apply colored uh, kajals because I think that will just give you a pop of color in your eyes and uh, uh, without doing anything it does look very pretty so if you're a beginner then maybe in fashion brow uh, one side you have this powder sort of a tip and the other side is the normal pencil that you can fill your eyebrows in it is a retractable pencil of course you can just fill in your eyebrows uh, with this powder side and just define it with the, uh, the other side other option that i have is by the brand called Sivana. now the th so now the thing which i love about this Sivana one is that one side it has this it has this pulley so that you can brush out your hair and the other side is kind of like slanted I so the other side is kind of slanted so you can easily fill in your you know shape your eyebrows and then you can fill it in so that's why i love uh, this one this the only thing is that it just comes in brown color so uh, if uh, if brown suits you you can go for this one so now last thing is lipstick now for lipstick i've just posted a video on affordable lipsticks under 350 rupees starting from rupees 60 to 350 so if you want to watch that video just click here so many 23 options in that video for affordable lipstick starting from 60 to rupees 350 so you can just watch this video for lipsticks now guys that's it for today's video i hope that you guys like this video and i hope it was helpful for you guys just let me know in the comment section below about your video suggestions that what should i make next uh, in this affordable series so uh, yeah that's it for today's video if you haven't subscribed to my channel please hit the subscribe button and click on that bell icon to get notified every time i post a new video and i will see you guys in my next one. Bye.